How's it going everyone? Welcome back to Star Major. Today we're going to talk about the top 7 weird reasons why actors decline major movie roles. Let's start with weird reason number 7. Gail Sundergaard despised the ugly witch makeup in Wizard of Oz. Imagine accepting a gift but the giver decides to get it back to replace it with another one. That's what happened with the Oscar winning actress Gail Sundergaard for the movie Wizard of Oz. She originally accepted the Wicked Witch role and was supposed to appear glamorous and sophisticated, but after several makeup trials, it was decided that the witch was to appear gruesome and ugly. So Gail, unwilling to appear ugly in the big screen, backed out of the film and was replaced by Margaret Hamilton three days before shooting. Shocked? This is just the beginning. Number 6. Jack Nicholson, the ultimate fan, declining the Mosquito Coast. Ali Fox from the Mosquito Coast was supposed to be played by Jack Nicholson. The directors of the film were hoping to get Nicholson on board for the role of Ali Fox because they needed someone who could play a dangerous and offbeat person. However, we all know how much Nicholson loves going to LA Laker games. In fact, he places it in his contract that he could get time off to watch their games. Now the Mosquito Coast was going to be filmed on site in Belize during basketball season. So Jack said bye bye to that role. I guess that's what it means to be a die-hard fan. Okay, let's move on. Number 5. Jason Momoa is way more than that. Guardians of the Galaxy We all know how Jason Momoa is known for his tough and silent characters, so it would make total sense that he would play Drax the Destroyer for Guardians of the Galaxy. But surprise surprise, he backed out after auditioning because he didn't want to be pinned for playing the same type of characters in the majority of his movies. Drax, who had a few lines that just had to show his muscular body, made Jason say, Been there, done that. Next we have... Number 4. Lawrence Fishburne didn't like it that way. Pulp Fiction. If you love your role, you'll do great in it. For Lawrence Fishburne, he turned down the role of Jules Winfield in Pulp Fiction because he didn't like how heroin was used throughout the film. He said that in this Tarantino film, it made heroin use seem attractive, which didn't sit right with him. Although Tarantino originally wrote the role of Jules Winfield for him, the role eventually went to Samuel Jackson, who did a great job. Number 3. Charlize Theron is still young. Wonder Woman. When news was spreading how Charlize Theron was up for the role of Wonder Woman, she had to make it clear to everyone that she wasn't chosen for Wonder Woman, but instead for her mom. According to her, Hollywood was trying to tell her that, yup, you're getting old, so this is the role that suits you best. She was greatly offended, and a part of her knew that it's not time to play grandma just yet. Don't worry Charlize Theron, you're still young looking to us. Number 2. Curious Tom, Edward Scissorhands If we talk about Edward Scissorhands, we are reminded of the outstanding performance of Johnny Depp. However, what if I tell you to imagine our Mission Impossible star Tom Cruise as Edward Scissorhands? Yup. Directors were eyeing Tom Cruise for the role, but Tom couldn't understand how the character worked at all. As an actor, you want to be able to understand everything about your character. So Curious Tom stormed the crew with questions. One of the unanswered questions that made Tom decline the role was, how does he go to the bathroom? If we think about it, his question actually makes sense. However, the writers of the movie were not able to answer all of his questions, resulting in him declining the role. That's when our guy Johnny Depp stepped in. Number 1. The Loving and Loyal Liam Neeson, Goldeneye Last but not least, this man is known for his action films such as Taken and Unknown. But did you guys know that Liam Neeson could have been an action star earlier if he was not struck by Cupid's arrow around that time? He explained why he turned down the super spy role for Goldeneye in an interview. He said that if he had taken that role, his late wife Natasha Richardson wouldn't have married him. And as our romantic action star said, he definitely wanted to marry her, and from what we could tell, he definitely didn't regret it. That's it for today folks, thanks for watching. If you enjoyed the video, please hit the like and subscribe button. This is Star Major, see you next time.